We're going to use this delicious chocolate chip cookie and this computer model to learn about fractions. Let's take a look at the cookie, and quite a cookie it is. A large chocolate chip cookie from the cafe next door. Now, if I were to begin to eat this cookie, I might realize it's pretty big, and I don't want all of it right now. So I'm going to divide it into equal parts. Often, this is what you do when you're sharing the cookie with friends, for instance. You divide it up equally. So here I've divided it in half, and now I'm going to cut it again so that now I have four parts, and they're pretty equal. I've done a pretty good job. So we can call these fourths. Here is one-fourth, two-fourths, three-fourths, four-fourths. And if I were to eat one of those, why, I'd be eating one-fourth of the cookie. Let's take a look at the model and see how it works. So here's a circle, kind of like the cookie. And we can divide it into equal parts. If we divide it into two equal parts, we call those halves. If we divide it into three equal parts, why, they're called thirds. Four equal parts, fourths. Here's fifths. And here we have sixths. Let's go back to the fourths because that's the way we divided up the cookie. So if I shade one of those, I'm saying, well, that's one-fourth. And that's the amount of the cookie that I was saying I was going to eat. So one-fourth, one out of the four equal parts is shaded. Let's take a look at the number. It has a denominator, that's four, and that describes the total number of equal parts. And a numerator, one, the number of shaded parts. So here we go. It's time to eat one-fourth of the cookie.